Hey guys, Busmaster81 here. Today we're going to do a educational video. So. So today we're going to talk about a school bus manufacturer. What is IC bus? That's what we're going to be talking about to today. IC bus information. IC Bus, originally IC Corporation, is an American bus manufacturer. Headquartered in Louise, Illinois, IC is a wholly owned subsidiary of Navistar International with its manufacturing base in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Established in 2002 by Navistar through the reorganization of sub subsidiary Manufacturer, American Transportation Corporation, Amtran. IC currently produces school buses and commercial use buses for multiple applications. IC bus information continued. The IC company name stands for Integrated Coach, alluding to how the vehicle vehicles are nearly completely assembled under a single corporate structure. For all vehicles, the body and chassis are assembled within the same manufacturing facility. The latter is designed by parent company Navistar. Prior to 2015, Navistar included the engine. While using a chassis and hood shared with their national brand trucks, IC bus vehicles have separate badging. IC vehicles are produced at the facility, fa facility opened by Amtran in Tulsa, Oklahoma in 1999 with a secondary facility in Conway, Arkansas. The latter ended bus assembly in 2010. CE Series the IC Bus CE Series is a high four Type C bus with an integrated chassis and body. It is primarily used in school bus applications as well as some commercial applications. The bus was originally introduced by Air National Bus as the IC integrated chassis in 2000. Air National had previously acquired body manufacturer Amtran and developed the new body design. Photo pictures of the Baldwinville, Baldwinsville CE's photo fo credits at LT-164, everyone. CE series continued. Photo credit to LT-164 again for the pictures. The IC used the Air National 3800 chassis. The front end received a different grill with vertical openings instead of horizontal. In 2002, the IC was renamed CE, with Air National Bus taking the name IC Corporation. IC Corporation introduced the new 3300 chassis in 2005, replacing the 3800. The front end had restyled fenders, headlights, and grill. Grill. The chassis used all steel cage construction. The three-piece easy tilt hood allows for easy access to the engine compartment. The body of the CE used uses threaded steel frame construction that interlocks the roof bows, drip rail, and roof stringers into a single frame unit and 16 gauge steel side sheets. 
In 2006, IC Corporation introduced International Aware Vehicle Intelligence Solution Factory Installed Telematic System. They also include the Leave No Student Behind Alarm System, which requires drivers to disable an alarm at the rear of the bus before exiting as standard. In July 2006, IC Corporation unveiled the diesel electric hybrid version of the CE at the New York Association of Pupil Transportation, NYAPT show. The hybrid CE uses an 80 kilowatt parallel hybrid system from Anova Systems with the international VT365 diesel engine. IC Corporation won a contract to supply up to 19 hybrid school buses in 11 states. In 2011, IC bus switched to a parallel hybrid system from Eaton. As an alternative to diesel, IC bus began offering a propane powered version of the CE in 2015. It uses a 8.8 .8 liter engine from Power Solutions International as a more economical option. IC Bus introduced a gasoline-powered version of the CE at the 2016 North American School Bus Conference and Trade Show. It uses a gasoline-fueled 8.8-liter Power Solutions International engine. IC Bus made Bendix electronic stability control and Bendix wingman collision mitigation standard on their buses in 2018. The collision mitigation system provides driver alerts, adaptive cruise control, automatic braking with optional lane departure warnings, and speeding alerts. A 360-degree camera system co-developed with Roscoe was also made available. I see RE series. The IC Bus RE series is a high four rear entered engine type D school bus. It was introduced in 1996 by American Transportation Corporation Amtran, which had recently become a subsidiary of Navistar International. Amtran would eventually be renamed IC Bus. There's the RE. ICRE series continued. The RE series is built on the Air National 3000 chassis. The RE200 used the similar displacement engine, and the RE300 used the larger displacement engine. For 2010 to 2017, only the larger Max Force DT was available, and those designations were phased out. Beginning in 2017, the RE series is only available with the Cummins L9 engine. The RE features the same headlights as those used on the second generation Air National S series. With the reburning of Amtran in 2002, the IC logo was placed above the door and the most Navistar logo was placed between the headlights. In 2005, the roof was reshaped with a more round appearance. For 2009, the headlights received black bezels, bezels, <coughs> bezels and the area between them received more detailing. And the driver's seat was moved forward, outboard, and upward for better visibility. In 2018, IC Bus introduced full view camera technology by Roscoe. The camera system, in conjunction with mirrors, gave drivers a full view around the bus. The same year, IC Bus introduced other safety features on their buses electronic stability control and collision mitigation technology. Those two features help drivers better maintain control and avoid collisions. The IC Bus FE300 is a high-floor, front-engined, transit-style Type D school bus 
built on the International 3900 chassis. The FE300 was discontinued in early 2010. There's a Florida spec IC FE. FE Forward Advantage. The IC Bus FE Forward Advantage is a high floor transit style Type D school bus. Introduced on October 30th, 2007, this redesign of the FE300 eliminates the protruding engine cover in the landing area at the front of the Calgary, known as the Doghouse with the use of the smaller Caterpillar C7. With Caterpillar exiting the bus engine market, this model is now discontinued. ICBE series. The IC, IC bus BE200 is a high floor type B conventional bus with an integrated chassis and body. It is primarily used in school bus applications and some commercial applications. The model bus was discontinued during the 2015 model year. <clears throat> ICAE series. The IC Bus AE200 is a high floor Type A conventional bus with an integrated chassis and body based on the Terrastar truck platform. It is primarily used in school bus applications, but is also available for commercial applications, known as the IC Bus AC series. The AC AE series was introduced in November 2010 and was discontinued in 2014. Storage wars. Intervention. Orders. Ghost hunters. Man hunters. Do you want... Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> Siri was talking. I guess it wants to know more about buses, Siri. So it decided to chip in. Oh, that's hilarious. Okay, let's get back to this. ICHC. The IC Bus HC series is a medium duty commercial bus with an integrated chassis and body. It was launched by IC Bus, then known as IC Corporation. In June 2006, at the Community Transportation Expo, the various other HC series models were introduced in 2010. By the end of 2016, the HC series no longer appears to be offered. The IC Bus LC series is a low floor bus with an integrated chassis and body. It has an all steel, steel inner cage structure with steel exterior panels and has a tilting three piece fiberglass hood. In 2014, the LC series was discontinued. The recent updated IC bus website had removed that product from its page. AC series. The IC Bus AC series is a commercial high floor shuttle bus with an integrated chassis and body built in co corp cooperation initially with Thor Industries, a layer of the Rev Group, formerly Allied Specialty Vehicles. Following its acquisition of Thor's commercial bus division, it was introduced in October 2010 alongside the AE Series school bus. The AC and AE Series were both discontinued in 2014.
RC series. The IC bus art RC series is a rear-engined mid-sized commercial bus. Trident Industries markets this bus as the Spectrum RE. Trident compares this coach of a cutaway but with improved features such as spacious underfloor storage and luxury motor coach feel. That's all, folks. So, yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Smash that like button in the face. Bye, YouTube.